Well, CES is an incredible glimpse into the most important gadgets of the future. And now while it's normally held here in Las Vegas, this year the convention is going virtual. And I'm sure after seeing Sam's forecast, a lot of people are very sad they're not here in Las Vegas this week. Companies are still using the CES platforms to launch their new innovations to the world, though, though it looks a lot different this year. Joining us today with the latest from CES is Tech Life columnist, Jennifer Jolly, thank you so much for joining us, Jennifer. How are you? I'm doing well. This is so weird. This would have been my 12th year, 12th straight year covering oh. CES in Las Vegas. So it's really weird not to be there with you right now. But as you know, every year we see our fair share of fringe, futuristic, and just plain fantastical gadgets. No different this year, but one of the best new gadgets that actually is practical, makes a lot of sense, and I've just done the first hands-on with it. It's this just unveiled Samsung Galaxy Chromebook 2. Now this two-in-one device has the world's first QLED display on a Chromebook. That's the same advanced tech Samsung uses in their best televisions, makes the visuals on the screen look so good, you feel like you can reach right in that touch screen and grab onto them. They also sweetened the sound, extended battery life, and lowered the price unheard of for the newest, latest, greatest gadget. The Chromebook 2 expected out in Q1 this year at a price point of just under $550. Wow. So the tech world's kind of reckoned with our world and our lives, especially during and after this pandemic, bringing us what we want, need, and can really, really use for a much more affordable price. Absolutely, now you mentioned the pandemic and obviously a lot of people's minds are on cleanliness this year. Have you seen any types of gadgets that are new and out or futuristic focusing on cleaning? So many anti-germ gadgets in every shape and size coming out this year from giant robotic UVC lights to sterilize entire rooms all at once to germ crushing backpacks. This two office antimicrobial backpack from tech accessory company Targus is made out of a water resistant silver ion material. So there's actually germ and bacteria fighting features and fibers embedded throughout this entire backpack, which really can help create a cleaner barrier between the outside world and your safe little bubble at home. This yeah. should be out by April, running around $120. Okay, now a lot of us spending more time at home. I love looking at smart home and home tech every year at CES. It's a huge category. Any favorites in that, in that section? So many cool products coming down the pike this year in the smart home world, but one of my favorites, Kohler's newest touchless toilet. No what? need to flush with your fingers after all when a wave of the hand does the trick. Same thing for its newest touchless faucets with integrated sensors to keep you from accidentally going fingers on with any kind of gross germy Ooh. surfaces. Also, super big buzzword you're going to hear over and over this year, more delight out of your smart home gadgets like the Moxie shower head. That's that high end Bluetooth speaker that magnetically attaches inside the water flow of wow. your shower, pumps out the tunes, and then you just grab it, take it out and take it with you when you go. And then check this out for the most luxurious life at home, the stillness bath, a Japanese Zen like square tub with mm -hmm. light, fog and aromatherapy. I mean, who needs to take an expensive trip to a spa anymore when you can just put one of these in your own house? Can you imagine that? Uh, yes, I sure can, Jennifer. Every time you mention a product, I'm like, oh, I want that one. <laughs> no, wait, never mind. I want that one. Culminating with the tub, you wouldn't get me out of there until I turn into a prune. Okay, so anything else you want to share and where do we go for more info? Well, this Sync Indoor Smart Camera is one more quick standout that I've already been able to go hands-on with just over the past weekend. It has night vision, two-way audio. You can look at the streaming video from your mobile devices, but what's really new and cool, you can save clips locally to an SD card. That's a nice touch for folks who don't wanna deal with, say, a subscription mm -hmm. or upload potentially sensitive video to the cloud. On top of that, there's this little front cover that you can slide up, which cuts power to the microphone and covers the lens entirely. Another awesome nod to privacy-minded design. Hits store shelves in May, just under $70. 
I'm about to post all of my first impressions, early looks at my website at techish.com. All right, Jennifer, thank you so much for joining us this morning. We're definitely going to be keeping an eye on your website to see more on what comes out this week. We'll, we'll uh, be in touch with you later. Thank you.